teachers, friends, and fellow students. I have the great honor and pleasure to present the valedictorian speech of the class of 2006. I'm honored to be a valedictorian for a second time in my college life. In 2004, I obtained an associate degree in marketing from the Dimitrius Perizis College, where I proved my excellence by being a valedictorian of the class of 2004. Today we have gathered here for a great cause, to celebrate the 2006 commencement ceremony, our graduation. It seems to me as if it was yesterday when I first enrolled to this college, and I'm sure that all of my fellow students would agree that time flew very fast. And here I am standing in front of you, giving a speech and wondering if this is real. To keep this speech close to the traditional valedictorian speeches, I will first talk about why our life at ACT was interesting, and then I will talk about our ACT family. Dear fellow students, I believe that many of you would ask the question why life around us at ACT had been so interesting in the past years. After everything that we learned and we didn't learn, everyone that we met and we did not meet, all the friendships that we made, after all the beginnings and ends, after all the excuses that we gave for handing in papers late, after all the deadlines that we viciously tried to meet, after all the chats in the college cafeteria, after all the time that was available for us and we still didn't have time to do all the things that we wanted to do, after every desk that we sat on, after every wall, after every of our successes and failures, from the past to our new start into the future, after us, the generation of 2006 will always exist in ACT. Our life at ACT seemed interesting because we went through all this. We were here to prove our existence, to live every moment, which is now of great importance. When we came to ACT, soon we became part of a family that accepted us so easily. In this family, we went through many things together. This family gave us strength and courage to aim at what we wanted, to aim at our dreams. All those hugs me, one's rose. To dream anything that you want to dream, that is the beauty of the human mind. To do anything that you want to do, that is the strength of the human will. To trust yourself, to test your limits, that is the courage to succeed. The ACT family taught us how to think and what to think. It enabled us to think for ourselves instead of memorizing the thoughts of other men. We will always be part of this family, no matter where we go, no matter what we do in life. Now we stand at a crosswalk. Some of us will turn left, some right, and some will continue straight. Whatever we end up doing in life, I believe that we will accept all the challenges because the ship in our harbor is safe, but that is not what ships are made for. Two days ago, my father said to me, every one of us has his or her lucky five minutes. For some people, those five minutes last for many years. For some people, those five minutes last for ten seconds. It is up to you to use those five minutes. I personally believe that all of us will use their five minutes wisely in the future. Coming to men, I would like to thank all my professors for giving me valuable knowledge that will help me towards the future. I owe a special thank you to Mrs. Lindsay for giving me the chance to study at ACT. Without her help, I would not have been able to stand here today. I would also like to thank Mrs. Yakumpu for the wonderful two years that I spent working in the Career Service Office at ACT. I owe a special thank you to Mrs. Pirotis for giving me the chance to study at the Dimitris Pirotis College. Finally, I would like to thank the three most important people in my life, my mother, father, and sister. 
thank you for all the support and love in the past four years. Thank you for helping me support my Just like what I just said, we started a new order. We have 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 a new order. We have